Come on, Rachel, we're already late. And the memorial's about to start. I can't find my phone. I think I lost it. Can you call it? I swear, you're always losing things. Let me see this. There. You know, you need to start being more responsible with your stuff. Responsible? Are you kidding? I'm not the one who got us late to begin with. Oh, sure, yeah, blame it on me like you always do. You know, I was waiting for 30 minutes, and just because I needed to use the bathroom before we left doesn't mean I'm the one who made us late. Can you lower your voice? You don't have to be so aggressive. You're making us even more late right now. You know what? You can sit by yourself. Good! I didn't want to sit with you anyway. Hello everyone, thank you so much for being here to remember my wife Josephine. She was an amazing woman, always put others before herself, and loved her family more than anything in this world. I want to share a personal story with you about something I really regret. If there is anything or there is any advice I can give you from my 25 years of marriage, it's to spend more time loving each other and less time sweating the small stuff. You see, the last time I saw my wife, we had gotten into an argument. You know you left the toilet seat up again. How many times have I asked you to stop doing that? Well, why don't you just push it down? It'll take a lot less effort than coming here and complaining. <sighs> Omar, all I'm asking you to do is just to please simply push the toilet seat down after you used it. I mean, is that too much to ask? Look, honey, let's just not argue about this, okay? Omar this, Omar that. Why does it always have to be my fault? <laughs> you know, it wouldn't be your fault if you would just simply push the toilet seat down like I've asked you to do a thousand times. You know what? I'm gonna go watch the game somewhere else. I am so sick of this. You're sick of this? I'm sick of you! That was the last time I ever saw her. She ended up getting into a car accident later that day. And now, all I can think about is that those were the last words I ever said to her. I want you to know that I put the toilet seat down for you this morning. And that I'm not sick of you. I love you. And I miss you so much. So you see, Please, spend more time loving each other. And this time, sweating the small stuff. Thank you so much for listening. Look, Justin, I just want to say... I am so sorry, Rachel. I'm sorry, too.
You never should have thought about something so small. I know, it's so stupid. I'm not sick of you. I love you so much. I love you too. I promise. Going forward, I'm gonna spend more time loving you and less time sweating the small stuff. Me too. Hey, Darman fam. I hope you love that message about why you should never sweat the small stuff. I appreciate you watching. And remember, we're not just telling stories, we're changing lives. And when you share my videos, you're helping to change lives too. I appreciate you and I'll see you in the next video.